Hi there. Welcome to Lights Out Storytime. My name's Sally Bates and I work for the Houston Public Library. We have so many good stories in our library and I have one to share with you. This is a story from a collection of stories by Katherine Munson Foster called Ghosts Along the Brazos. Now there was a girl and her name was Musetta. She lived in a town called East Columbia around about the turn of the last century. She lived on a farm, but every week she would have to come in and stay with her aunt and uncle because she had to go to school in town. She stayed there for the week and went home on the weekend. She stayed with her aunt and uncle in a house right along the Brazos River. And she didn't know it, but there had been a woman killed in that house. When her aunt and uncle had moved in, they had found the body. Everybody knew who did it. It was the woman's husband, but they never caught him. Well, they didn't tell Musetta this. So it was strange that she didn't like to be in the house by herself. She would come home from school. She would open up the door and she'd call out to see if anybody was home. And if nobody was home, she'd back out, go play with a friend, sit on the porch and wait for somebody to come home. One day, Musetta got home from school. She flung open the door. She called out. She heard something upstairs, like somebody rustling. She thought maybe it was her aunt. So she came inside. She put her books on the table, shut the door behind her, and looked up the stairs. And when she did, she saw a woman there, but it was not her aunt. And Musetta knew that this woman was not alive. She was wearing a gray taffeta dress with a high collar and long sleeves. And she started coming down the stairs towards Musetta. Musetta could feel the cold coming off of her and she wanted to run. She wanted to scream out, but she was so scared. Down the steps, the woman came one after the other closer and closer, and then she lifted her arms as if she was going to give Musetta a hug. Musetta could not move. Finally, the woman was standing right in front of her, and her fingers brushed Musetta's shoulder. And when that happened, a cold heat went right through Musetta, all the way down to her bones. She screamed. She turned. She grabbed the door. She wrenched it open. She ran. She ran as far and as fast as she could. She ran until she got to her parents' farm. And after that, she said, I will never, never go in that house again. And she never did. But after that time, other people saw the woman, the woman in the gray taffeta dress. Some people saw her coming through the walls of the house. Some people saw her after the house had burned down moving around the ruins of the house as if the house still stood. And sometimes people still see her walking down the road in her old-fashioned dress. When the mist comes off the Brazos or it's twilight time between day and night, maybe you should go down to East Columbia and see if you can see the lady in the gray taffeta dress. Thanks for joining me today. See you next time.